How to fix the USB flash drive if it's not recognizing by Windows 10, 7 or 8 computer? Hello and welcome to Easy Tech Geek. Today in this very short tutorial, I'll tell you six powerful and easy way to fix if your USB flash drive is not recognized. Just trust me and follow the steps which I'm gonna show you. You may have tried many steps by yourself, but by following these six steps one by one, I'm sure that it will definitely fix your problem. So let's get started. So the very first step is restarting the machine. Yes. So sometimes whenever we restart the machine, all the USB root generic devices gets active and it start working. So let's say if that works for you. The second is trying a different machine. Now when I say trying a different machine is just to check if that device is working in any other second computer or not. If yes, then we have very high probability that this has to work in the main computer and should work after we perform all those six steps. Alright, so just check this to any other device if you have any other computer. The fourth important step is changing a power, power management settings for USB. And how we can do that? I'll let you know. It's very easy. So here in the search bar, type run and click on open. And here type dev mgmt dot msc and hit enter. Once you enter, you will find a device manager window. At the very bottom, you will find universal serial bus controllers. Here, look for USB root hub. Select it do a right click and go to properties and here in the power management make sure you do the check mark for this and click on OK. Now since I have two USB root hub I'll do the same on both the USB root hub. I'll just go to right click I'll repeat again do a right click go to properties power management allow the computer and OK so once it is done there is one more step which we will do is updating the USB port driver and how we can do that it's very simple just do a right click and click on update driver so if that updates for you it's well and good if it doesn't not an issue just follow the sixth step is to change the uh, USB selective suspend settings that's a very powerful uh, you know tip and how we can do that is in the search bar type power and you will find power and sleep settings so click on that please and here at the right hand side you will find additional power settings once you click on it you will find this window click on change plan settings then again change advanced power settings and here in the power options look for USB settings and find USB selective suspend setting just click on the plus icon make sure it is disabled so let's say if it is enabled just make sure it is disabled and click on apply and OK once you're done with with all these six steps just restart the machine and see if that works and if it doesn't please let me know in the comment section I will definitely reply to it and please hit like for this video and please do subscribe just hit that subscribe button I need your support have a wonderful day guys take care